Well, there you have it. They've announced the DJI RS4 Pro. Now, I am so excited because I get to keep my credit card in my wallet and not buy it. It looks great, but nothing else really has changed for me in the way I shoot to utilize that gimbal any different to the RS3 Pro. So I'm pretty pumped that I don't have to spend any money and get too excited about the upgrade. Interestingly, the camera weight has stayed the same. So the payload is 4.5 kilos on the RS3 Pro and the payload is 4.5 kilos on the RS4 Pro. So nothing much has changed there. I really did like the new vertical to horizontal quick release option there. That's super cool. The other thing that did interest me though is the smoother adjusting of the arms. That is something that I would love. It's great to see that they are doing some finer adjustments to make the gimbal better uh, and just that usability because that is something I do kind of struggle with sometimes is when the camera's on there and I'm trying to make adjustments, it's a bit tough and yeah, a bit jumpy to push it through. So for the people that are thinking of buying the 4 Pro, I think if you're sitting on an RS2 or something like that, then you will definitely notice the difference between the 2 and the 4. But if you're currently sitting on the 3, I really, without having tried the 4, I really can't see there being enough of a difference to warrant upgrading from a 3 Pro to a 4 Pro. So maybe just keep your credit card in the holster, keep it dry, don't pull it out. And um, surely next year, the next kind of iteration of the 5 will be a game changer for uh, lack of a better word. So anyway, pretty exciting just to see new gear out there and what people do with this one. But for me and the way I shoot, I'm totally stoked staying relaxed, goosebumps are down, happy with my 3 Pro and uh, no need to buy anything tonight. So hope you have a great week, enjoy the rest of it and otherwise we'll catch you very soon. Cheers.